That was a rough race. Yeah, that was not the best race I've had. Um, yeah. What do you chalk it up to? Um, well, I'm, I'm not going to let this one race define me. And I feel like this doesn't reflect who I am as a runner or as a person. So it's a little disheartening to have this outcome, but this isn't the end of my season. So. You talked the other day about kind of racing with expectations. Mm -hmm. Is that on your mind again today? Kind of, you know, being having the favorite label. Um, yeah, but I don't. But I didn't recognize myself as the favorite. But it would have been nice to win at the, uh, the last NCAA meet at Hayward. Um, but I went out there and I did the best that I could given the conditions and given how I was feeling. Um, so. Speaking of the conditions, they were they were pretty good today. All this oh. rain. Best conditions ever. <laughs> Just kidding, it was actually terrible out there. <laughs> but I mean, um, that's not even an issue because we all ran in that weather. So. It looked like you were right up there with maybe until about 200 to go. What yeah. was your experience coming down the back stretch on the second lap? And kind of, can you talk through how that played out for you? Um, yeah, I, I kind of tripped up a little. I tried to just hold it together after that. Um, but I just gave it all I could with that last. To go. You got tripped up a little bit on the back stretch? Yeah, I got a little tripped up at 200 and like just along the way. But I mean, it's okay. I mean, it's not the best thing. I just have to work harder and better and just uh, reevaluate the race and hopefully do better next time at USA's. Is there anything that fell off? Like, did you feel yourself or you know, anything that went into the event? Yeah, I felt myself. Um, I, I was just a little thrown off, but I shouldn't have let it get to me. Um, but it was a lesson learned. Thrown off by what? Just thrown off after I tripped. 